Good afternoon, this is Stuart from We Sell Homes in Paradise and we are at a beauty in Mijas. This is called Villa Sol y Viento. It's a huge villa. We're talking about 696 meters squared built on a plot over 1300 meters squared. It's got seven to nine bedrooms. It's got so many interesting features. It is a passive house, meaning that it actually produces enough energy for itself over the year. And we know where energy prices are going right now. We'd like to take you on a tour of this property, but for now, just admire its wonderful facade and its location. So, are you ready to come on a property tour? As I mentioned earlier, this is 696 meters squared built, so there's a lot to see. Come on inside. Obviously here is a ground floor, and what's interesting about this floor is there's already a room to sleep on this floor, a bedroom. And to the side here, we have a really nicely done bathroom. This property was built in 2014 with further um, elements added by 2016. I think what's most interesting to see is this vaulted ceiling where they hang out and play music. This is a family home and a home which you can really bring a lot of guests and entertain in. If we work on through, a very large open living area leading out to the terrace and the pool area. Huge kitchen island, we've got Siemens appliances. Inside here is a pantry, which is quite interesting, and some of the air filtration systems. So we mentioned that this is a passive house. The passive house being creates its own energy. It also has an air filtration system. It's actually designed and made by an architect who's very well respected, a German lady and this is her dream home which she built for herself. Coming out to the terrace area, follow me. So coming out to the terrace area, we have this lovely covered portion of the terrace here. So you can escape the Spanish sun when you need to, but really nice is this pool which has a cover and actually is a heated pool. So we spoke earlier about energy needs. Obviously when you're producing energy, you can heat the pool very cheaply indeed. And over here, we have a wonderful view of the Fuengarola skyline all the way down to the sea. So what I love about this property is its orientation. This is southwest orientation and I really like the facade. You have brand new windows, you have a nice, clean, modern design, lots of outside space. This is what people are craving right now. And of course, this particular property has all the added benefits of all the modern functions and features for a passive home. So back on the ground floor to orientate yourself, just coming in from the hallway, you have this lovely bathroom here. And this is an interesting space because it's a large bedroom, but it's on the ground floor. So if you do have family members that find it difficult to get upstairs, then this is ideal. Interestingly, the architect actually left a space within the walls to put a lift shaft. So you can actually put a lift afterwards to move between the three floors. So let's move upstairs. Upstairs we find three really good sized bedrooms and this, let's call it foyer area, is a nice space where you can play and have the kids playing and I'm going to show you each bedroom. So this bedroom is really nicely done and what's great about it is it has this lovely terrace as well which you can see, looking out to the swings and the children's play frame. So as I mentioned earlier, there is space for a lift shaft, which is here behind this door. Here you have a really nice utility area. I think that's quite important because we're talking about practical needs here with a terrace to dry your clothes. Moving on through, we have the upstairs bathroom here, very nicely done as well. Everything's really neat and tidy. And off to the side right here is another really good sized bedroom. 
with a private terrace looking over to Mijas Pueblo. So, this is where the magic happens. This is the master bedroom and it's really large. Wonderful views, as I mentioned, the southwest orientation. When you work on through, you'll see that we have this amazing terrace. If you think the views downstairs were good, look at these views here. And what's really romantic is at night time, you see all the lights in Fuengarola twinkling. Great sea views, great orientation, and down below currently zoned as rustic land. 